Good morning guys. It is, what's today? Saturday morning. It's about, I guess it's 11 o'clock so it's kind of early afternoon but um, I've been up since 9 o'clock this morning. I got ready, waited for my mom so that we could borrow her car because Matt needs to go to the grocery store and Macy had to go out of town for something to do with her work. So he needs to ride to the grocery store because they have literally no food left in their house. So mom was like, just take me to work and y'all can use my car. So that's what we're doing so far today. I just wanted to get the vlog started. Darcy's got me, Justin's sister, has got me wanting to do Vlogmas, which if you don't know what that is, it's where you vlog every day until Christmas. Um, I wish I could do that. I want to so bad, but you guys know Justin works all the time and I don't always have a vehicle to like get out and do stuff and have stuff to film. So I don't know. I wish I could do it. I really want to, but I'll for sure do it next year. Anyways, I'm here to get Matt. Uh, we're probably going to eat our breakfast first and then go to the store. So we'll see what we get into today. So mom got us burritos on her way to pick me up from Brahms and no offense to mom but they were terrible so now we're still hungry so we're gonna go find something to snack on and then go to the store but bless her heart she tried to be nice and get us breakfast and they weren't that good but anyway she don't have to know that we didn't eat them we'll just be like oh they were delicious thank you mom <laughs> downtown shops looking around Matt's trying to find a gift for Hillary I think she liked this she doesn't watch our videos I'm pretty sure so it's a Kylie lipstick kit I think she would like it and then if not they got single lipsticks and eyeshadow That's and stuff that. it's a good thing Macy didn't come with us because she would be sucker Matt into buying that for her she loves cheetah print and stuff and it's like a Christmas wreath Fox hair, no. Yeah, it's fox fur. Oh, faux. That means yeah. fake, <laughs> fake fur. A lot of people say that. Yeah, it's soft. Was it like a snuggie or something? <laughs> My bad. Uh, there's these people I watch on YouTube. She she tweeted the other day. She was like, I never knew it was pronounced faux until today. And she was like, I'm 20 something years old. But yeah, a lot of people Think don't know that. Shit, cause you know where you're <laughs> Guys, I'm thinking about purchasing this Christmas tree dress to wear on Christmas. Not really. How itchy would that be? <laughs> I mean, I guess you could wear something under it, but that would be really itchy. That would drive me crazy. <clears throat> yeah. Why'd you start dancing? <laughs> Hopefully Justin doesn't watch the video because he might have got a sneak peek. I don't think I showed it. We found Justin a gift. And it's nice. Alright, we've been shopping around for a little while. And now, we're going to grab some lunch. I'm going to get the hibachi chicken. Matt. I don't know yet. I'm probably going to either get the uh, New York got sushi, but I don't like sushi. New York strip. These what's aren't bad the, lunch prices. What's the Yankee Niku and shrimp? <laughs> Yaki Niku. I don't know. I have no idea. Mm -hmm. So guys, I just came home. Um, I went and got Justin's prescription for his asthma. You guys, some of you may know he has asthma. I think I've only said it in one or two videos. But anyways, he's at work uh, today, so he wasn't going to have time to go and get it. So I went and got it for him. I'm going to relax for a little bit. And then uh, after Justin gets home, I'm going to take my mom her car back and... Um, I think Matt was wanting to do something later. I'm not sure what, but we'll see. Um, a, a weird thing just happened though. Me and Matt, we went to his apartment and we started looking through, um, the fire stick that we got him and we were trying to figure out what movie we wanted to watch. And we ended up picking Ace Ventura. I think it's the second, second one I want to say. Um, and then Hillary sent me a Snapchat. They're at home. Uh, they're both off today. So she sent me a Snapchat of them watching the same movie and I was like, what the hell? That's so weird because... I mean, that's a random movie. I mean, I guess any movie would be a random movie, but I don't know. I just thought that was super crazy, and they were only like 15 minutes behind where we were in the movie, so I thought that was super crazy. Anyway, kind of a random little story there, but I wanted to share that because I just, that made me feel really weird. 
But yeah, I'm gonna go in here, relax for a little bit, and then we'll see what we end up doing tonight. Hey guys, so it is Sunday. It's a super freaking boring day today. We yet again did not have family day. I'm beginning to think that um, we're no longer a family because <laughs> nobody wants to hang out. No, I'm kidding. Everybody's been working a lot and just tired and I know everybody likes to have their day off to just relax and chill and they don't always want to be around a whole bunch of other people. So I understand that. Justin is at work. He has, he works tomorrow, which is Monday. He'll be off Tuesday. He works Wednesday and Thursday and then he'll be off for not quite a week. So far he has been scheduled to work one of his days off, but He'll have at least a few days off, which is going to be so freaking nice. I'm just ready to be able to spend some quality time with Justin because he just hasn't had many days off lately. And I've been missing him and he probably doesn't miss me, but I miss him. So I'm ready for him to have some days off. And I know he's exhausted and worn out and ready to be able to relax for a couple days. So, so Justin just got home and um, he came home. I don't want to like give a whole lot of detail or, you know, say anything because... With his job, he's a nurse, in case you guys don't know, and he's a nurse at a resident, or at a resident, oh my gosh, I can't even think, at a nursing home, so he takes care of patients, you know, older people, residents, people who need, like, physical therapy, um, you know, things like that. Anyways, um, someone, I'm trying not to get emotional, someone passed away there today, and it was someone that he really liked, it was one of his favorite residents, and he just was really emotional when he came home, and I just feel really sad for him. Um, that's all I'm gonna say because, like I said, you know, you can't talk about stuff when you work at a nursing home, but, um, oh, pulled my glasses off my face. Anyways, I'm gonna try and find him a card just to tell him thank you for what he does and stuff like that, and I'm gonna take it to home to him. I'm not gonna film his reaction or anything like that because I don't wanna put him on the spot, you know. Men don't like to show their emotion emotions anyway, so. Uh, I don't want to put him on the camera and, you know, put him on blast, but I'm going to find him a thank you card while I'm in the grocery store, um, but I'm at the grocery store because I wanted to get, uh, I'm going to make turkey burgers, but uh, I wanted to get some lettuce so that we can have, obviously, lettuce on our burgers and then have a side salad, and then I might get stuff to um, make some st stuffed jalapenos. I can't talk right now, um, but yeah, I just wanted to share that with you guys, so let's go get the ingredients we need and get him a card just to tell him thank you and that I love him and stuff like that. So let's go. Got everything I need for the stuffed peppers. I got the lettuce. Now to find a card. Thank you is what we're looking for. So let's see if we can find him a good one. I think I like this one. It just says thank you. And when you open it, sorry, when you open it, it says very much. That way I can write in it and make it kind of unique. Okay, so we're ready to check out. Actually, I think. I think I'm going to get him a candy bar too, one of his faves. This is his favorite, in case you're wondering. Okay, he asked me to go get us a drink too, so I'm trying to hurry and fill out the card. So I didn't record any of that, plus I only have two hands and it's kind of hard to film while I'm writing. But anyways, I wrote, Justin, I don't tell you thank you enough for all that you do. You're, you're amazing in every single way. Thank you for always working hard for us. Thank you for putting up with me at my best and my worst. And thank you for being a nurse. I can never do what you do every single day. I am so blessed to have you in my life. I love you so much. Love, Misty. So, that's it. I just wanted to tell him thank you. Like I said, he he's an amazing person to be able to take care of people and to deal with all the stress on top of that. And I don't know. I just could never do it. But anyways, I got to hurry and go get us a drink so that he doesn't think something fishy is going on. So, I'm going to go do that. And then I'm going to go home and cook us some dinner. Justin's getting gas because he has to go to work tomorrow. Like I said, he'll be off Tuesday and then he'll work a couple more days. And then he'll be on his days off. Um, but he's almost out of gas. So he has to get some gas for work tomorrow. He's had a bit of a stressful day, huh? Mm hmm <laughs> And he's... It's like, I hate stressful days because we always do this. And I've said this before, like, when you're stressed out or when you're, like, kind of depressed... You start thinking about like your life and what you want to change and like 
different things like that. I do that all the time. I'm like, I'll, I'll wake up in like a sappy mood or like, I don't know. And then I'm like, oh, my life's so terrible. This, I have this and this I want to change or this and this. I don't know. But I mean, it's true. Those are your goals. You want to do that stuff, but you like get down on yourself about it. I don't know if that makes sense. You've, you probably, if you've experienced it, you know what I'm talking about. But anyways, that's the kind of mood Justin's in tonight, huh? <laughs> mm -hmm, pretty much. I hate it, but. It's funny because like three days ago, I was like, oh, you know what? Our lives really aren't that bad. And yeah. I, I just gotta, it's just you your know, mood. Like, It'll change it. tomorrow. and It will. And then I'll be, I mean, usually like whenever I'm like this, I get super motivated and I'm like. I gotta there, do this. Sitting there and thinking about all the stuff that I can do to get you where you want to be. Get where I want to be. And then like, the next day I'm just like, oh, you know, it's not. My life's not too bad. Not bad again. And yeah, I'm like, we do that. Just back time. and forth, back and forth. I can't ever stay in one mood. Yeah. But we're, like we said before, we're trying to work on things to get closer to our goals. It just takes time and it sucks that it takes time, but everything takes time. So. We just have to work towards it. We're just talking your ear off now about the stuff that you probably don't care about. But just know that reaching your dreams takes some dedication and some time. And it just doesn't come easy. So it doesn't happen overnight. Yeah. Well, thank you guys so much for watching. Give this video a thumbs up. I hope you guys enjoyed. And I will see you guys on Wednesday.